Hey everyone, it's Sania with T Bright Saves, and I'm bringing to you all the digital deals that you can do at Walgreens this week. This is just some of them, but you'll be able to get free Colgate, free Crest, cheap laundry detergents, and also cheap Scott products. We're going to be doing three different transactions if you're a complete beginner, and if you have the spend 20, get $5 off, you'll be able to do that in the last transaction. If you want to skip around during the video, there'll be time codes in the description and a link to a printable breakdown. If you see the Sunday paper at your Walgreens, you can use your points to pay for it and still get those inserts that you need to do your deals for the week. My store is all out of the IVC coupon booklets. It looks like this. This is the Instant Value coupon booklet, which has all the Walgreens store coupons that can be combined with manufactured digital coupons or manufactured paper coupons. Last week, two boosters showed up on my account. One was 10% off of $35 and the other was $5 off a $20 purchase. Not everyone gets these boosters, so if you have it, I will be showing you a deal that you can do for the spend 20, get $5 off in this video. Revlon and Alme are buy one, get one 50% off, and when you buy two, you're going to get a $4 register reward. As you can see, my store is completely out of the Kiss Bombs. They are $4.99, as you can see right there. But online, they are actually bringing up a $3.69, so you can get a price match for this. So all you need to do is to ask to speak with the manager, show them the item on your phone, and they should be able to price match it for you. All stores are supposed to price match, but not all of them do. So I will leave a link in the description showing you where on the Walgreens website it shows that they should price match. So if you can find a store in your area that will price match, you can do that this particular deal there. So you're going to pick two of them up. One is going to be $3.69. The second is going to be $1.84. So the total is going to be $5.54. If you have points, you can use it to lower your out-of-pocket. And then at the end of the transaction, you are going to get a four dollar register reward for purchasing two so that's going to make this a dollar 54 for two or 77 cents each we have a couple oral care deals going on this week so if you like colgate this is the deal for you you are going to buy two colgate so you can have the total sf or the max fresh they're going to be 2.99 and when you buy two you're going to get 3000 points so you're going to pick up two of them at 5.98 there's a 3 off 2 coupon for the total sf and there's also a separate $3 coupon for the Max Fresh. And if you like the Colgate Optic White, those are a part of the deal as well. So you'll pick up two for $5.98. The $3 coupon will come off, leaving you with a balance of $2.98. If you want to use points to pay, you can. And then you're going to get the 3,000 points, which is going to make this free and a two cent money maker. The smaller size Crest 3D White and also this green Crest Pro Health are three dollars and when you buy three you're gonna get a four dollar register reward this mouthwash is a part of the deal so you'll pick up three of them for nine dollars there's a five off three digital coupon which is going to leave you with a balance of four dollars if you want to use four thousand points to pay you can and then you'll get a four dollar register reward at the end of the transaction once you get the $4 register reward, this is going to be completely free. Crest is a part of PNG, so if you buy these items, submit your receipt to pggoodeveryday.com so that you can get points for purchasing these items. If you have the Crest Pro Health at your store, it's a monthly deal that's going on, so when you buy two, you're going to get 5,000 points. They are $3.79, so because it's regular price, you can use this 25% off coupon. I'm going to have it linked in the description so you can print it out and use it at your store you can use it multiple times but some stores might take it so you might want to have multiple copies so one deal that you can do is you can pick up four of them at $15.16 you can use the 25% off coupon that's going to take $3.79 off leaving you the balance of $11.37 the five off three coupon will come off you'll have a balance of $6.37 if you want to use 5,000 points you can and then you're going to get 10,000 points back for transaction number one, we are going to pick up four Colgate, so we're going to get two of the Total SF and two of the Max Fresh. 
that's going to total $11.96. Then we're going to use two $3 coupons that are digital. It's going to take $6 off, leaving a balance of $5.96. Then if you have points, you can use 5,000 points. And at the end of the transaction, you're going to get 6,000 points back, which we're going to use for the second transaction. I already handed the cashier all my stuff, but you'll give them all your stuff to scan. Then you can enter your number on the keypad, or you can give them one of these to scan. I just finished at checkout, and everything went perfectly. You can see that everything rang up like it was supposed to. The $6 came off. The subtotal was $5.96 plus tax. I used 5,000 points, paid $1.68 out of pocket. And right here, you can see bonus points. I got back 6,000 points, and we're going to use that for the second transaction. Scott paper towels are $5. Scott toilet paper is also $5. And as you can see, they have changed the color. I think it was pink, now it's orange. The Kleenex is also a part of this deal. It's $5. And we have a $1.25 coupon in the IBC coupon booklet on page 10. It's gonna take $1.25 off of each one, making it $3.75. But we got three $1 coupons, one for the paper towels, one for the toilet paper, and also one for the Kleenex, which is gonna make this just $2.75. Kleenex and Scott are part of Fetch Reward, so if you do this deal, make sure you submit your receipt to Fetch to get points back. Fetch Rewards is a rebate app where if you submit your receipt, you are going to get points back for purchasing items that are on the app. Once you have a certain amount of points, you'll be able to submit for a gift card. If you are brand new to Fetch, you can use this code right here to sign up and you'll be able to get your first 2,000 points. Dixie Paper Plates and Bowls and also the cups are buy one get one free you can see maybe you can't that they are $3.99 we also have a one dollar digital coupon which is going to make it $2.99 for two of them or just a dollar 49 each the complete home baggies are buy one get two for free if you want to mix and match you can they are $2.79 a piece so you'll buy one for $2.79, get two for free, which is gonna make it $2.79 for three, or just 93 cents each. Kellogg cereal are $1.99, and there is a 50 cent digital that's gonna make them just $1.49. Some of these are on Ibotta. I know for sure that the Frosted Flakes Marshmallows is giving back a dollar on Ibotta. And there are other ones included. Just check your Ibotta account to see which one is available for you. So if you get the dollar back for the Frosted Flakes Marshmallows, that's going to make it just 49 cents. Ibotta is a rebate app like Fetch Rewards where you will get money back instead of points for items that are on the app. Once you have $20 in your account that you have claimed, you will be able to cash out. If you are brand new to Ibotta, you can sign up using this code and you will get a special welcome bonus. In addition to that, you'll get to be a part of my Ibotta team. If you are able to print out coupons, you can go to the Kellogg's website, I'll have that linked in the description, and get a $1 coupon for the Frosted Flakes Marshmallows, which will end up making it free after the Ibotta rebate. The mini Baby Bell cheese, they're the three count, are $1.99. Since it's regular price, you can use the 25% off coupon. That's going to deduct 50 cents, leaving you with a balance of $1.49. There's a $1 off one coupon that works for any Baby Bell cheese, and that's going to make it just 49 cents for this cheese. Oscar Mayer wieners are $3.89 and they're buy one get one free. So you'll pay $3.89 for two or $1.95 each. Oscar Mayer wieners is on Fetch Reward. So if you purchase them, make sure you submit your receipt to Fetch to get points back on these items. Condiments are also buy one get one free. So if you purchase these Heinz ketchup right here for $3.49, and you can mix and match. It'll be $3.49 for two or $1.75 each. If you want to get the mustard and the relish, you can mix and match. It'll be $3.29 for two or $1.65 each. Heinz is a part of Fetch Reward, so if you purchase these items, make sure you submit your receipt to Fetch to get points back for these items. 
These Flips Milk Chocolate and Dark Chocolate, the white chocolate is all gone. That's the one I really wanted. They're two for $6. There's a $1 coupon in the IBC coupon booklet that's going to take a dollar off of two. So you will pay $5 for this, but you could submit to Ibotta to get 75 cents back on each one. So you'll get $1.50 back. That's going to make this just $3.50 for two or $1.75 each. Trident gum is two for two dollars. We have a 50 cent coupon in the IBC coupon booklet that takes 50 cents off of two. So these would just be a dollar fifty for two or 75 cents each. Check your stores to see if you find these Keebler cookies with the M&Ms. They're on clearance for two nineteen, and there's a one dollar digital that I found on my account. So that will make this just a dollar nineteen. These are all of the items for the second transaction. The total for these items is $10. There's $1.25 that's going to come off of each of them from the IBC coupon booklet, which is going to deduct $2.50, leaving us with a balance of $7.50. Then the two $1 coupons are going to come off, which is going to leave us with an out-of-pocket of $5.50, but we have 6,000 points from the first transaction so we can use 5,000 of those points and that's going to lower our out of pocket to just 50 cents for both of these items. I just finished at checkout and everything went perfectly. The paper towels and the toilet paper both rang in for $5 and the $125 for the IBC came off without any issues. The two $1 coupons came off leaving a balance of $5.50 plus tax. I used 5,000 points and paid $1.10 out of pocket and I will be submitting my receipt to Fetch so that I can get points back for purchasing these products. These are all of the items for transaction number three. The total for both of these items is $3.98. First 50 cents will come off for the bluebells for the 25% off, leaving a balance of $3.48. We have $1.50 in coupons that will be deducted, leaving a balance of $1.98. We have 1,000 points from the first transaction so if you want to use that you can use it to lower your out of pocket to 98 cents i have 2000 points on my account so i'm going to use 2000 points and just play tax out of pocket for these items if you don't want to try the bluebell cheese you can omit that and just buy the frosted flakes then make sure you submit your receipt to ibotta for the frosted flakes so you could get a dollar back I just finished at checkout and everything did not go exactly as planned. You can see that the Frosted Flakes did ring up for $1.99 and so did the Blue Belt Cheese. But first thing, I forgot to use my 25% off coupon. I noticed this as I was looking at the receipt. Don't be like me. Make sure you use your 25% off coupon because you'll get an extra 50 cents off. The $1 came off for the Blue Belt Cheese, but the 50 cent coupon did not come off come off for the frosted flakes so i will have to call walgreens so that they can give me points back for that particular coupon not coming off you can see that my subtotal is two dollars and 98 cents plus tax and it should have been 248 plus tax then i use 3000 points to pay you probably will only be using 2000 points or 1000 points depending on what you have and i paid just six cents out of pocket Make sure that you do submit your receipt to Ibotta so that you can get a dollar back for purchasing the Frosted Flakes with marshmallows. This week, L'Oreal Elvive, or Elvive, however you say it, is two for eight dollars. There's a two dollar coupon in the IBC coupon booklet on page 28 that will deduct two dollars, leaving a balance of six dollars. We have a four dollar digital coupon that's going to take four dollars off of two, making it two dollars for two or just a dollar each. Garnier Fructis is two for seven dollars and we have a four off of two digital coupon. Once that's deducted, that's going to make these three dollars for two or a dollar fifty each. Big pens and pencils are buy one get one free. Some of them are as low as $2.99. We do have digital coupons for a dollar off so check to see what coupons you have to see what pens or pencils you can get and that's going to make it a pretty good deal. If you get the ones for $2.99 it'll be $1.99 for two or just 99 cents each. I already got my five-star notebooks for early activation but 
if you're not able to do early activation, you can do this deal instead. They are two for $5, and this is the one subject notebooks. You can get the big ones or the small ones. You'll pay $5, and then you can submit to Ibotta to get a dollar back on two. You can submit to Checkout 51 for a dollar 25 back on two, and also Saving Star for a dollar 25 back on two. That's going to make this a dollar 50 for two or just 75 cents each. Checkout 51 and Saving Star are rebate apps like Ibotta and Fetch Rewards where you submit your receipt and get money back for purchasing items that are on their website or their app. Saving Star is a little bit different. You have to make sure you link your Walgreens account to Saving Star, clip the five star notebook or items if they're still available, and then after you purchase the items, you will see it show up in your Saving Star account after a couple days. If you are new to Checkout 51 or Saving Star, I will have the links for both of those apps in the description so that you can sign up and get started. Tide Simply Pods and also Tide Simply Liquid is $2.99. There is a $1 coupon for both the liquid and also a $1 coupon for the pod. So depending on whichever one you buy, it's going to be $1.99. Oh, and I forgot, the Downy is also included. There isn't a separate coupon for the Downy, but it will be $1.99 after you use the coupon. All is on sale this week for $2.88. There's a $1 digital. Once you use that digital, it's going to be $1.88. I am lucky to be at a store that actually has paper products, but if you're at a store that does not have any paper products, you can do this deal for transaction number three instead of the Scott paper products. So you'll pick up one of the all, one of the Tide Simply pods, and one of the Tide Simply liquid. The total for all of them is going to be $8.86. There's a $1 coupon for each one. That's going to take $3 off, leaving you with an balance of five dollars and 86 cents we have five thousand points from the first transaction so once you use that it's going to be 86 cents plus tax that you would pay out of pocket so if you don't have any paper products you can do this deal instead for transaction number four i'm going to do the spend 20 get five dollars off deal if you don't have the spend 20 get five dollars off you have done the first three transactions and you'll be good to go if you have the spend 20 get five dollars off you could pick up one of the all two of the l'oreal l vibe my store only had the shampoo and i really want to try this so i just decided to keep the two shampoos two of the colgate total sf two of the colgate max fresh the total for all of these will be 22 dollars 84 first the two dollars is going to be deducted for the l'oreal l vibe leaving a balance of 20 dollars 84 then the five dollars off 20 will be deducted, leaving a new balance of $15.84. There are $11 in coupons, so the out-of-pocket is going to be $4.84, but if you have points, you can use it to lower your out-of-pocket even more. Then, at the end of the transaction, you are going to get 6,000 points back, 3,000 for each of the co for every two Colgates that you have. So this is gonna end up being free and $1.16 moneymaker. I wanted to do the Crest deal to get the register reward, but this particular account that has the spend 20 get $5 off does not have a Crest coupon, so I could not do that deal. So if you want, you can substitute the Colgate for three of the Crest so that you can get a $4 register reward instead of getting points for the extra Colgate. I just finished at checkout and everything went perfectly. You can see that the Colgate rang up like it was supposed to. The All rang up for $2.88. The L'Oreal All 5 rang up for $8. And you can see where the $2 IVC was applied. The 5 off 20 came off without any problems. Remember, you cannot use a percentage off coupon and the 5 off 20 coupon. They will not work together. All my coupons came off perfectly. My subtotal is $4.84 plus tax. I used 5,000 points, paid 91 cents out of pocket. And you can see right there, bonus points, I got back 6,000 points for the Colgate. These are all of the items from all four transactions. For transaction number one, the out of pocket was $5.96. If you did not have any points, if you have points, your out of pocket will be 96 cents plus tax. For transaction number two, the out of pocket was 50 cents. For transaction number three, it was $1.48. But if you had points, it might be that you're only paying tax for that transaction. For transaction number four, with the spend 20, get $5 off. 
the out-of-pocket was 84 cents. The total for all of these that you had to pay out-of-pocket was $8.78. But there was 6,000 points that were received at the end of the last transaction. So the final cost would be $2.78 for 15 items or just 19 cents each. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that it was beneficial and that you are able to do some of these deals at Walgreens this week.